Good morning, everybody. This is Moment of Destiny with Pastor Adebo coming your way this glorious morning. I want you to know that God has something in stock for us today. We want to start by giving thanks. I commonly say, thank God is Friday. And we are thanking God. It's another Friday. And that beginning of a weekend, I want us to thank God for the faithfulness of God we have seen in the week. It has been a very eventful week. Let's appreciate God wherever you are. Please, can you open your mouth and give him thanks? Appreciate him right now. Bless him. Let him know that you are grateful. It's only a fool that is not grateful. Go ahead and appreciate him. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. We give you glory and praise. Be thou exalted, O God. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Mazuge, Gadege, Garaga, Mashe, Tandere, Boboboya. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Father, we thank you. Receive all our praise, O God. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. We've we'll been talking about faith. Uh, welcome all of us to the School of Faith. Uh, this is a faith injecting platform. Uh, I believe God by the time uh, you are through with this today's broadcast, you are going to test positive for a prevailing faith. And yesterday I was talking about uh, 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 the place of faith in the marketplace and I made it clear to us that you need you have to add to faith. And faith is what you add to, to be able to accomplish the things you want to do. That's a competitor one five. And also, I started talking to Russell about the fact that faith is can be defined as partnering with the invisible. From Hebrews 11, 24 to 27, the Bible says that uh, uh, um, at Moses, he, he, he feared as one that is seen the invisible. Uh, that is, a faith played a major role in what Moses did. And that same thing I want to introduce to us. Bible says that by faith, Hebrews 11, 27, he forsook Egypt. Moses was doing fearing the wrath of the, not fearing the wrath of the king, not fearing it. For he endured as, as one seeing him who is invisible. He endured as seeing him who is invisible. In other words, uh, 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 faith can be defined as partnering with the invisible for the purpose of doing the impossible. Uh, it is, if there's any time we need to partner with the invisible that will enable us to do the impossible, it is now. Moses was in an active partnership with the invisible God that enabled him to do the impossible in his time. Uh, what does that mean? Faith empowers you to do the impossible. And, and how does that operate? It means when you are operating in faith, you are connecting with the invisible God to win invisible battle. It's a joy and peace. There's a joy and peace that come with defeating the plan of the enemy. I prophesied over somebody right now. Every invisible battle around you and within you, I see you overcoming them in Jesus' name. Sometimes it can be more challenging uh, to overcome them, but the good news is there is hope to win spiritual battles happening within you and around you that hope lies within the profound insight from god's word that will keep you uh to go to battle and be victorious that is what i want to say to many of you that are listening to me when you connect when you are operating by faith when you are standing on faith on god's word when you stand violently on god's word when you stand on the promise of god when you are acting on what God is asked you to do. What you are doing, you are activating the invisible God to go to war on your behalf against invisible battle. And that is why I promise to somebody that listen to me right now. Every invisible battle around your life, they are destroyed in Jesus' name. There's somebody listening to me right now. On your right eyes, you are having some sensation there that is a healing touch. Be healed in Jesus' name. Be healed in Jesus' name. Be healed in Jesus' name. Let me begin to pray right now. We are standing by faith. The Bible says Moses, by faith he forsook Egypt, not fearing the wrath of the king, for he endured as seeing him who is invisible. I begin to pray right now. 
every invisible battle, every invisible arrow being thrown at you will stand right now by the spirit of faith and taking the shield of faith. Ephesians 6 verse 16, faith is your shield in the battle of life. Faith is your shield. Faith is your armor. That is why you cannot afford to go to a battle undressed. When you don't have faith, when you don't take in faith, you are not taking the shield you need to deal with the invisible battle. Never go to any battle undressed. And one of the ways to dress for battle is take in faith. Faith is your shield in the battle of life. Faith is your protection in the battle of life. Begin to pray right now and say, Lord, I take in the spirit of faith. I pray right now. The Bible says, taking in the shield of faith, we'll be able to quench all the fiery dust of the devil. Right now, begin to pray with me. Lord, I quench every fiery dust of the devil. My father, my father, my father, I quench every fiery dust of the devil around me. Every fiery dust against my head. Every fiery dust against my children. Every that against my career. I quench it now by the spirit of faith. I quench it the way water quench fire. In the name of Jesus, I pour the spirit of faith into to, to, to quench every attack on my head, every attack on my children, every attack on my finance, every attack on my life. I quench it now with the spirit of faith. What water is to fire is what faith is to that. I dissolve them. I paralyze them. It is done. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. If you are not born again, this prayer after me. Lord, you are come to right now. Forgive me my sin. Watch me to your blood today. I receive as my Lord and Savior. Thank you for my soul in Jesus' name. I pray. Amen. Join us for the live program today. I join me for prayer today. Winning invisible battle by faith. You win your invisible battle by faith. Join me for that prayer. 7 p.m. Um, UK time. Uh, it's going to be 3 p.m. watching this time right now because of the time has changed. Join me on Zoom. Zoom and number you join is 530-377-8530. Join me on Zoom by 7, which is 3 p.m. and by 8 uh, on Facebook and YouTube on Adiboy Tomeo Ministries page and Destiny Monday TV. Don't miss this program. Your life will not remain the same again. God bless you. Bye-bye.